Hey, bro, you and her not incompatible. Y'all get along just fine in y'all right mind. It's just that she have a few demons in her from she got from other guys throughout the years doing sexual activity, intercourse. You already know that intercourse is an exchange. It's a physical exchange and a spiritual exchange. So a lot of people, they exchange telegony, DNA molecules. We all know that. But most people don't know you exchange generational curses and uh, demons as well. Sometimes some people have angels around them because they have generational angels that's been looking after their family. Some people have generational demons that's been dealing with their family. So we also call them generational curses. So you gotta be careful. It's just that, it's not that you guys not compatible. It's just that one of you guys got some demons in you. You need to go to the altar and get them prayed out in Jesus' name. What's going on is this person that they don't feel easy around you, something uncomfortable because their spirit got demons attached to them, which causes them to kind of like be resentful towards you. You're like, what is, why is me and this girl, why this girl acting like this? Why is she acting like that? She know you good for her, but them demons in her. So they, they, they making her hesitate or they trying to convince her, give her a different idea, all kind of stuff. And then you got angels near you. They chasing the demons away. The demons like her. She might be a good host. She might be emotional. She might be revengeful. These are the type of people that demons like to um, be inside of. They like to be inside of people that that's capable of doing some evil. And that's why some demons stay around people longer because some things in their personality allow them to get some things done. A revengeful person, an anxious person, um, a, you know, a, a high sex drive person, Um, people that anger stuff like that it, anxious demons can do a lot in those type of situations so so just be mindful of that that you get along with a lot more people if you go to the altar get those demons out your system. I'm Alan Rillionaire. Look in the description box. I need you to subscribe to my Patreon. I'm going to have uncut, uncut content in my Patreon that I'm not able to express on here. But in the Patreon, subscribe to my Patreon and you're going to get uncut Alan Rillionaire. Much love to you. Everything you need is in the description box. Take care. Stay blessed. Stay prayed up in Jesus' name. Okay? I'm Alan Rillionaire. All newcomers, welcome to Rillionaire Nation. We got the new Rillionaire t-shirts on deck. We got the Rillionaire t-shirts on deck. Uh, one of, one of, a member from, from Rillionaire Nation wanted me to make that shirt, so... You want those shirts from me? I told you they $50. Send me a message, your size, and all that to my email or my Instagram. Either one. Preferably my Instagram. But um, we can get those shirts to you ASAP. With your size and address and all that good stuff. Hey, much love to y'all. See y'all next time on the next video. What's up, Rillionaire Nation? This your brother, Alan Rillionaire, Alan Williams, the Rillionaire, the Rillionaire, AWTR. I'm all in one. 
here to let you know if you want your Pookie and Ray Ray reading their anthem shirts. Send me a message on Instagram along with your shirt size and everything. And uh, let me know your address. And um, the shirts are $50. So you pay. And then let me know your size and address and the shirt will get sent to you, okay? And any other shirts that you want from me, let me know and I'll send it to you to send me the information and I'll send it to the Cash App or PayPal $50 and your shirt will be on the way ASAP. Much love to you. Reading Nation, I'm out.